Hey guys, to the Death Metal Gamer here, and I'm back at you with some Seven Days to Die. This is gonna be Seven Days to Die Part Six, and in between episodes, and I just hit that fucking barbed wire fence. But uh, in between episodes, I found a house. I've been really working on some shit. I set up my game settings, so it's gonna be day seven, so I'll be putting my settings back up and the difficulty and all that kind of stuff back up, so I can properly fight day seven which I really don't think anybody cares what I do as long as I just have fun with it because that's all I'm that's all I'm doing but yeah I found a nice house um, moved in pretty much set up a lot of spikes I'm probably gonna have to put up a lot more for day seven and I found a lot I just found a lot of cool shit too I found uh, some I, I found some actual shit found a pistol, found some rounds, I found some crossbow schematics, which I have been looking for s these. And uh, first aid kit schematics, so that's fantastic too. Which now I can make a fucking crossbow. So let me see here. Let me just go through my weapons. Wherever they are, weapons, there we are. Crossbow. Oh, yeah, that that's pretty easy to make. Oh, and I'm able to make steel now. So, yeah. As you can see, I have a lot of that. But now I can make steel now. So, yeah. And, and a cool thing is, too, I actually ended up finding this forge in here. So, that I didn't have to do much for. Which I am glad. Because finding making forges are a pain in the ass as it is. So that was just pure luck. Now I can finally get a crossbow. <coughs> and I'll probably make some steel crossbow bolts. Which I do have some feathers. But I think they're in here. Yep, right there. I'll have to go look for some more fucking... Um things. It's just I just want to look at this thing. Oh man, it looks nice. It looks nice. Um and med kits actually. Hang on. I can actually make a rocket too. I uh, didn't even know I didn't even know I actually had a schematic for that. Um, iron crossbow bolts will probably be a lot easier for me to do. Hang on. What do I need? Oh, arrowheads. Only gonna make 14 of those since I only have 14 feathers. But yeah. Still working on my levels, still trying to get that shit upgraded. Um, I think I should be alright as long as I put some spikes right there. Because the problem is there's gonna be mutated. God damn it, hit that again. I'm probably, you know, thinking about it. I should probably do this. Hang on. First off, I'm gonna get rid of that. But I am gonna make a roof. Like uh like an escape route, I guess. Pretty much this will be my escape route for day seven. And I'll probably have to do a lot of repairs when there, when those guys come. 
but it's not going to be that big of a deal. I could probably take them. Mm -hmm. Here, this done, and I'm going to make these. I can make steel ones. Go fourteen. All right. Ah, there we go. Just let me go to my skill points real quick. I have five. Just for this. Oh, I just realized my food is down. Eat some of this. Which I will eventually have to go hunting for some more food. Ooh. Excuse me, but I don't know when I will. Uh, I guess it'll just depend when I feel like it. I got a new chair, though. You know, that's, uh, that's always nice. I have no fucking idea what I'm going to do with this. I guess I could put it there. So yeah, this is uh this is the uh this is the house. I like this house. It's just got a nice like I don't uh, actually I don't know. I don't know how how I would say how I feel about it, but I can I can definitely say that I love it here. Because, come on. It's not the most perfect house, but, you know, there's already stone outside, so I don't really have to worry about that for now. Which I think, I think I already have cement mixing. Yep. I'll have to do that next. Because once I do that, then I can start reinforcing that house with concrete. I set the spawn rate to def like to absolute not like nothing, but zombies still spawn, not as often, but they do still spawn quite regularly. But it's to a point where like you can go a couple days without having a zombie, which I prefer that because I prefer to do my work like to just work instead of just being bothered by a bunch of zombies and losing a lot of shit. And it's like I said in previous episodes, I'll be changing my settings at some point when my, for one, when my bludgeon weapon damage is up a little bit more, and my archery is up a little bit more, and when I'm really set up. Which I pretty much am now, but I'm just not ready for that because I'm still quite a noob at this game, so I just want to make things a little easier for me now, and then just do the harder stuff later. So yeah. Which, like I like I said, I really don't think you guys care about that. You know, I, I, it's my game, so I can do whatever the hell I want with it. But, yeah. Plus, honestly, this game's fun. You know, it has its bugs, obviously, if all games do. Graphics are, are not the best, but... Uh, that really doesn't... Graphics don't necessarily make a great game. You could have a game that has some of the best graphics in the world and ended up being a piece of shit. There's Assassin's Creed fucking... Uh, what was it? It was it was one of the Assassin's Creed's. It was very buggy. Graphics were fucking amazing. 
It was a good game, but at the beginning it sucked. I forgot what it was called. My brother beat it a couple times. We'll take that. I went over here before, but I ended up going back because I had so many zombies on me. So I'm just checking it out now. Which I found out, too, that uh, a good place to find leather, if you really don't want to do the skill point for it, a good place for leather is, uh, what is it, um, like these, pretty much, but in like the bookstores, the black ones, those are great for leather. I really don't know what I would need. Coffee beans, you know. I, I guess I can make myself a nice cup of coffee, but, you know. Crafting repair kits, huh? Really don't need that. Um. I will take this, though. I need to start making my steel stuff. I'm gonna head back over to the house. See, I still don't understand why my game is doing that. It's just making everything drop into the water. Oh no. I really don't care though because I'm not living in an area like that now. So it doesn't bother me. I ended up happening to kill a... I had to fend off a bear in between episodes. I was trying to get it away from me, but right here I had a barrel, which I'm probably going to set up the one I grabbed if I... St yep, right there. So that way, if I have a problem, I'm going to put these, like one right here. Which, these are easy to make, it just takes gasoline, and gasoline is extremely easy to find. All you need to do is just go fucking get some run-down cars. Ow. I gotta stop running into that. Okay, steel. I'm gonna make a whole shit ton of it. Here we go. And I think for now, I'm gonna put some of this stuff. Actually, I'm going to make a new chest real quick. There you, there you are. Well, I didn't mean to make two, but alright then. Uh, I guess i put that there. Um, stuff I really don't need right now. Nope, nope, need those. Need those. I'm really enjoying uh, doing this, re you, like recording this for you guys, and I hope you guys are enjoying. Uh, ow! God damn it! Fucking ran into it again. Ah. Uh, anyways, I'm gonna end it right here, guys. Hope you're enjoying the series. Um, like the video, subscribe, share, do what the fuck you want, and I'll see you metalheads later.